Good evening. I am Baptist Archbishop Walter Dixon of Forgiveness Missionary Church of Christ out of Atlanta, Georgia. And this evening I learn of an unfortunate situation that we all have to face that our sister in Christ, Sister Ashley Horry, daughter of uh, our brother Robert Horry, former NBA player, lost his daughter Ashley. And unfortunate, many of us have to face this day that Sister Ashley have been faced with. And being a father of four daughters, one of them that has an illness, and at this point an incurable illness, but we know that God and our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ has the final say-so over all of us. And I just wanted to provide this prayer and some small token as a comfort to the Hurry family. May we pray? Our Father who are in heaven, God of eternity, life is precious to each one of us. And even though we want to say no to death, we see death as the dark mysterious enemy that destroys the good that you have created and help the loved ones and family of our beloved sister in Christ 17 year old Ashlyn to see death as you see it not the end but the beginning oh father not a wall but a doorway not a dark road but a path that leads to eternal light and life Oh, Heavenly Father, we'll miss our sister in Christ, Ashlyn. But we thank you, Lord, for memories. May our minds and hearts be filled with the wonderful recollection of her past. Help us, Lord, through our sadness, wear a smile as the passing of time wipe our tears away, oh, Father. Time can be a great physician when it heals the void that we now feel. And every life is a gift from you, O merciful Father. Thank you for sharing the life of Ashlyn with us and those who know her and love her. Lord, help make her family an instrument of your peace. Where there is hatred, let them so love. Where there is injury, place in their hearts, pardon me. Where there is doubt, let them have hope. Where there is darkness, let them see light. Where there is sadness, let them have joy. Oh Lord, grant that they will be consoled by family, friends, and loved ones. That they may be understood as to understand. To be loved as to love. For it is parting that we are parting. It is dying that we are born to eternal life. In your Son, Jesus' name, Amen.